Alrighty, I'm going to create a series of objects that are hierarchical. So I'm going to uh, let me just zoom in here for just a sec. So I'm going to create an empty object here, and then I'm going to add a cube, and I'm going to add uh, what else? I'm going to add a sphere. Okay, so I'm going to add those two objects there. Um, and then I'm going to move the sphere slightly above there. Okay, so now when I click on that game object, I can move the, the object as a whole. And if I just zoom out just a little bit there, which is great. But if I click on the sphere, or if I click on one of these objects, then um, it doesn't, it only, it doesn't select everything. So uh, maybe I, I don't want that. So when you have a, like a prefab, uh, what actually happens is that it, it, if I select a child object, then it uh, selects the whole object. And the way to do that is I'm going to create a script here called, um, let's call this selection base object. Okay, for lack of a better word. And I'm going to open this up here. And my selection base object is just going to have, oops, it's the French version there, uh, is just going to have this attribute associated with it. That's all it's going to have. So now, if I go back to here and I choose my game object and I add selection base object, now what happens in the scene is when I click this uh, sphere, which is the child of a child, then it will select the base object. And you'll see that now the base object is selected, so everything gets selected. And no matter what one I choose, the base object is always selected. Now, what you can do is if you want to actually move that sphere, so let's say I want to actually move that sphere, I just click on um, the cube again, and then I get access to there. And similarly, sorry, I, I said sphere, but I meant cube. And similarly, if I if I want to uh, access the sphere, I just double tap it again. So if I want to move the, the main object, that's the main object. If I want to move just the sphere, I click on it again, and then I can move the sphere separately. And that is, um, that is selection base. Hi guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, this is part of the Video A Day in September 2017 videos. Uh, if you liked it or you didn't like it, hit the appropriate button below. Uh, subscribe, so if you hit the, the little icon over there, then you'll get notified, uh, especially when you hit the little alarm icon. That's the really important part, apparently. Uh, then you'll get notified when a new video goes up. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.